I always had this kind of special interest with the visual system. And um, to me, it was really, uh, I think, just um, very gratifying um, to be able to change someone's life in, in such an immediate way. The first visit typically is just to establish care at, at the clinic. Typically, they're referred to me by like a cornea specialist, but this is a kind of another kind of like subspecialty that, that um, not every optometrist does. So anyone with like a corneal disease or who is um, post any corneal um, surgery, um, oftentimes these surgeries or these, these conditions leave you with um, vision that's un uncorrectable with a regular pair of glasses, a regular even pair of contact lenses. A lot of the times that's not me giving them a glasses prescription, it's just giving them some bit of knowledge. T to me would be very like straightforward, but um, I think uh, any, any, anything, any bits of advice um, that you can offer to a patient um, that, that just gives them that resource to pursue, I would say, a more optimized lifestyle or um, you know, the ability to make somebody read well um, or um, uh, to, um, you know, watch their grandkids play sports or uh, see the board at school. I always tell people I like calling on the phone. So whenever everyone sends me a message, I usually like calling and, and, and talking to them because I, I think just that interpersonal feedback is, I think it's, it's, um, it's priceless and I think people really appreciate that coming, coming from a provider. I grew up in Northeast Ohio. so. Um, for me, it was really important to, to establish myself in the community and, and, and this is all a part of like, playing a pivotal role in the community and it makes you feel more, uh, more as a part of that like, cohesive kind of whole I'm from the area. And I had always kind of wanted to be in the Northeast Ohio area, um, even through school and um, going to Ohio State for optometry school. I, was, I never wandered off too far, um, so just special to me because this is home.